Hello everybody, today I will be using acrylics to paint the design of a Daruma doll on an egg. Quick disclaimer, I didn't take out the contents of the egg before I started. If you want to just paint on the shell, you can poke a hole at the top and bottom of the egg with a needle and blow out the egg. I know from previous experience that blowing the egg out is not as easy as it sounds, so I chose not to do it. Of course, if you don't extract the egg, you may have to throw the egg out a few months after painting it. So I started sketching out the features of the Daruma doll on the egg with a pencil. I decided to paint around the features with red because a traditional doll is red. And for the red, I used um, Chapel Rose. Because I'm using acrylic, I'm not too worried about making mistakes because I can easily paint over my mistakes with another color. Um, after I finished painting the top of the egg, I let it dry. Um, I also used a heat gun. Um, if you don't have a heat gun, you can use a hair dryer. I found that a heat gun works really well and it dried the egg within a few seconds. After I went over the red a few times, I started on titanium white. I realized as I was painting this that I really didn't need to paint the features before I started uh, painting the white because I ended up painting over them and um, redrawing the features again with pencil later on. I ended up uh, painting over the white a few times to get an even coverage before I moved on to the black. So when I was painting this, I kind of messed up a few times and went out of the lines, but um, because I was using acrylic, I was able to um, cover it up my mistakes with the red. After I corrected some of my mistakes with the red, I ended up going around the whole egg with the red because I squirted too much out of the bottle. After I covered up the white a little bit more, I went over the black parts again with a different brush this time because uh, the brush that I used previously for the black was um, synthetic and frayed a little bit at the end, which made it draw different lines that I didn't want around the black. Here you'll see me drawing over the features again with a pencil and um, I used a yellow to go around the eyes and then I drew the pupils of the eyes with black. For the mustache, the beard, the eyebrows, um, I used black to paint, and for the nostrils and the mouth, I used red. For this painting, I only used four colors, red, white, black, and yellow. So, thank you guys for watching my first YouTube video. I had so much fun painting this Daruma doll and making this video. I hope this video has inspired you to paint your own Daruma doll or paint your own egg or rock or whatever you find in your house or your neighborhood. Um, yeah, thank you for joining me in this video. Bye!